you guys give up give up 53 obviously but but, 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 but then then during that fourth four obviously you have to you have to have to come up with a stop there and then, then you, you guys stop them three times and then and the fourth one yeah, uh, well, takeaways, um, happy we won the game. It could be worse. We could have been on the other side of it. So, uh, you know, we started off a little bit slow. We played pretty well in the second and third quarter and then came back with a big stop at the end. So you're always happy to get a win, but we're not happy with how it happened. Uh, so we've got to play better than that. We want to be better than that, and we're working to be better than that. Are those explosives still, still the main concern for this defense right now? And how do you guys fix them with, with one regular season game left? In the fourth? Well, yeah, obviously that's the main concern is stopping explosives. And I wish there was a magic solution to doing it. It's making a play. It's when you're close enough to the receiver, you've got to find a way to get the ball out or intercept the ball and uh, you know make the tackles you're supposed to make fit where you're supposed to fit. That's how, that's how you stop explosives. There's you know no sit back and wait and see what happens. It's you've got to make a play when, when it's your turn to step up and make a play. What do you see on film from UW with, with, with a big quarterback and Jacob Eason? He probably compares a little bit to, to, to the last guy you guys played as far as arm strength and just you know, sheer size and everything. Well, him and Justin Herbert, all three guys are all monsters, You know, big guys that can really throw the football and uh, very accurate with the ball, has a lot of good weapons, a big offensive line, big physical athletic offensive line who can run the ball. And I'm sure that's what they're going to try to do to us. So uh, we got our hands full with another great opponent. Do you really do you really want want to eliminate kind of the the, 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 the space that Salvin Ackman has to run to? Because it you know, seems like once he gets into some space, he, he, he can really kind of turn on the Jets and, and beat just about anyone he faces with the running back there. Yeah, I don't know how you really eliminate the space. You control your gap. You got your nose in your gap. You know everybody has a gap, and you fit up the run plays the way you're supposed to, and then make a tackle. So, uh, you know that's how you stop the run, and that's what we're hoping to do. Do, do you get the sense that the community and the the, 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 the team is really excited for this game? Just, just being being around here for for, for one season, the, the Apple Cup seems to be a game that that everyone uh, really gets up for every year. Uh, I, I just you know we have a really good opponent come that we have to go play this weekend. I know we're really excited to play a football game. All that other stuff that's all outside noise that we don't really pay a whole lot of attention to. Uh, we have a good opponent and uh, really good guys at certain positions. So we, we've got to play a really good football game. I know our guys are excited to play a game.